probably got it tailored a bit, but whatever. Next stop, St. Patrick Street. Hey, Zay back on your screen with another vlog. Don't know what that snap was about, but as you saw at one point, I returned and repurchased this candle and this one, which I'm gonna decide which one I'm burning tonight. I didn't realize when I initially got them in the last vlog, if you saw, that the duties and exchange rate would kill your Canadian girl over here. So I asked them, and they're like, yeah, just go and we'll reissue you 20% off. And then when you buy it back in store, it'll be Canadian dollars and no duties. I saved $70 by doing that. Isn't that insane in the membrane? And that amounted to what I basically spent on groceries today. I went to No Frills and then Walmart. I was gonna film and show you guys like I like to do, make it cinematic too, but it was way too wild up in there. I don't think I've ever shopped on a Sunday. I know I've done Saturday morning before, but I've never done a Saturday supermarket run and never again, never again. I could be empty fridge, which would probably never happen, Hungry AF, nope, not doing it. It's just pandemonium up in there. I really need a toothpaste and Walmart is $3 cheaper than anywhere around here. Since I was in the neighborhood anyways, cause all my errands today were in the West End. I'm like, let me just pop in. I got that and pineapple from there, which I am not in the mood to cut tonight, even though I'm craving a smoothie. And I bet you my mom would say you're not supposed to have smoothie so late anyway. There goes the sticker. I'm a bit of a budget bandit, so I always like to see where I can save, especially since you know I like to spend in certain places. I wanted to try this tri-colored rotini. Don't know if it's good, but we'll find out. Today has been such a weird day. It's almost seven, so at least it's most ways done, except I haven't started editing at all. I woke up this morning, I'm like, thank God it's Sunday, and I just get to relax, and I'm like, wait, the vlog needs to be edited, uploaded, and posted. There's that. I haven't even done that because when I woke up, I've never felt that way in my life. My body didn't even feel like it was mine. I'm in the mood to do a chicken dumpling soup. The only problem is I wish I could just, and it'd be done, but that's not how it works in real life. So I don't know, I'm gonna have to find some energy somewhere to be able to do it. Otherwise I'll just eat meal prep tonight. I kind of changed a couple years ago, two to be exact. When my dad passed away on the 28th of October and then my auntie put the funeral on the 5th of November, which is my birthday, and things just were never the same. So now I look at my birthday as just a time to reflect and appreciate that I have another year of life and that I have to cherish the people that are here. I don't really want to do anything, but I also feel like if anything, I'll do a wine tasting because I've never done that before and you know your girl loves wine. But we'll see how this vlog ends. Just stay tuned. I feel like I said a lot in everything in the last couple minutes, plus how heavy are we starting this vlog off? a lot going on i thought i was gonna do a gym session this morning when i threw on my yoga clothes i'm like so i just put a blazer on top and that's what we're doing today okay i also have cold chills well chills are cold but you know what i mean ah <sighs> i hate this feeling i can't wait until i feel better i've had two of these and they're so nasty ginger lemon cloves i thought about putting garlic and there's another thing my grandma used to put in them that helps so much, but I'm like, this is already torch enough, why torture myself with torture tea? 
I have to find a way to get an appetite because I haven't eaten. And I definitely need to eat. That's like the worst thing about not feeling well. But I'm gonna pull it together, get through this day. <sighs> it sucks because I had errands to run after work today, but that's okay. That's okay. Ugh. I don't even have words, guys. I'm just so. I'm like tired and groggy and grumpy. You know what it's like. <laughs> I feel like a big kid. I decided to go out just to get some fresh air. Mask on, of course. Package! I'll show you in a sec. But I got a couple ingredients that I need for some things tomorrow. And birthday gift for my friend whose birthday will be going to on Friday I need to text about the details because I'm not happy with that but I think this is so pretty and he loves kitchen stuff so perfect anyways I'm gonna put back on my home clothes make another tea have another soup I wish I could say I'm just chilling tonight but nope two pods still gotta edit and upload that vlog is different a couple weeks ago I bought some teeth whitening and it wasn't it it tasted toxic like these taste bad normally but that tasted like just no, just no. so I'm gonna check these and start using them tonight <laughs> my teeth need to get back to a1 and then this is something I've been meaning to buy since June July <gasps> when you see you're gonna be like what is this a replacement for my very first tripod. I got this from Joby through Best Buy 10 years ago. And it was good for what it was, and I thought this camera was the same weight, but no, all the times that it's knocked over and I try to do aesthetic shots for you. So I said, girl, stop being a cheapo. You know me, I'm a frugalista, so I'm always trying to save. I have half the mind today to go back to the grocery store because they overcharged me $2, but I'm like, that's doing too much. Anyway. Amazon Prime came on time because they said it was going to deliver sometime today and it came earlier. It is, oh, well, I would try it, but of course you're on my bigger tripod, which I'm going to use for potting in a bit. So maybe we can test out this. But what I love about this is, hey, hey, hey. So if I ever want to have it at a different height, if I ever want to have it bent, because you know what? I preferred, when I used to use my camera to vlog, that my tripod was kind of like this. Wait, <laughs> this. You can tell I like gadgets. This is a throwback. I haven't used this. I don't even know if it has battery in it. Ah, no, it's dead dead. Because I haven't used it in months. I haven't vlogged with my camera. In, well, that's a lie. I still vlog with my camera all the time, but I just don't have the patience to go out with this. Although this makes the shot super smooth. Maybe when I get a new camera, whoa. I wish a camera could fit in here, but they made it only to fit phones. All that to say, I could vlog like this and look like a dork on the streets of Toronto. But no, for real, for real, I can wrap this around things, hopefully get crazy cool shots for the vlogs or whatever I film next. Because I think I might take a break from the vlog life. I've been doing it for two years. And there's more I'm going to say on Patreon, but I'll leave it there. So yeah, that's my super random Amazon haul. work Whew. don't sneeze don't sneeze the worst thing about being sick and single is when you have to run an essential errand something you can't put off you still have to put your clothes and go out so I'm gonna throw on I don't even know some jeans apparently it's really mild today 18 degrees if I didn't feel like I was dying 
Okay, I don't feel that sick, honestly. Okay, I do feel pretty sick though. It's so annoying. I swear I jinxed myself. If you watched last week's vlog, you know. I used a whole box of Kleenex today, thank God. <sighs> thank God for work from home day, so I'm gonna put these on. I don't know how to do the transition thing. You know what I'm talking about? I don't know if that transition worked. I tried, you know, I see it on TikTok all the time, but it doesn't mean I can recreate it. I need a sweater because it might be mild outside, but it's feeling like the Arctic inside. There's an ice box where my chest used to be, not my heart, my whole chest, because there's clearly a cold on there. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Should I be wearing sneakers or flats? Happy first of the month, by the way, if I haven't said that first. If I haven't said that yet, wow, I can't even formulate a sentence. Oh my gosh. Where's my mask? Terrible. Technically, this is me having an allergic reaction to something, but it comes out and comes off like a cold. P.S. How am I supposed to walk around with this big, long ting? Like, hello? Perhaps because it's meant for bigger cameras. <laughs> That's me. 90% of the time, if these are in, I'm listening to a podcast. That was the biggest waste of time. I went into the grocery store because there was a few things that were sold out the last time I went, and it's exactly where I needed to run my errand anyway. The way those lines were working, <clears throat> I can't even speak. The way those lines were looking and the way I'm sounding, it was a no. Even with my mask on, I'm like, I don't want to be that person. I'm out of here. And then I went to go get the one thing I needed, and I was kind of like, well, it's done. And now, I'm sure you can hear, I have some water on because I'm going to make dinner real quick, even though it requires a lot of ingredients, and then call it a night. Have you ever seen me this messy? The way this medicine has me, oh. I was talking to my friend from Sweden last night on Skype, which is also Swedish, by the way. How do I sound? Do I sound sick? Because I'm trying my best to not sound sick. Because the truth is, I'm not sick. I don't know how to explain this, but my friend and I are both allergic to the same medicine because he said he had the exact same joint pains, chills, fever, runny nose, stuffy nose, sore throat, but you're not sick. My brain doesn't work like this. <coughs> I did not sleep well at all last night because I saw on Twitter what happened to take off. Like I actually saw it and I'm not good at seeing those kind of things so doctor since this is an allergic reaction technically i can't get anyone sick i'm not contagious because it's not an actual virus it's just that my body is like what's all this bacteria from the antibiotic so that's good which means depending on how i feel i can keep my two appointments because i need a pedicure my feet these gargoyle feet are so bad and i don't know if i want to wear open toe shoes for my birthday that's if i'm even feeling better by saturday and then i need to get my brows done because just no, just no. So we'll see. I'm gonna wear my mask for either or everything anyway. Let's switch this out. Just because, first of all, this is giving needing to be cleaned. So that's what I'm gonna do. Guess what I'm having for lunch yet again? Soup. Thank God I make good soup and I'm not sick of it yet. I have one more bowl. I feel like I made more than I did last time. Or maybe just because I'm eating way more of it in such a short amount of time. I love when I talk to you and my head is cut off for half of it. Anyways, what was I saying? Okay, one, I think I'm going to put my mask on, run out, and go get things from the grocery store that I couldn't get because it was so busy yesterday. Two, 
if I really want to, I can sound like I'm not going through it with this damn antibiotic. I think my voice sounds better this way, but why would I force myself to sound normal when I don't feel okay? Three, I think in the next few hours I'm going to assess whether or not I need to cancel my appointments because there's that. Four, thank God I'm not sick of this soup yet. Five, I think Jeff texted me. Yeah. Let's see. See, the thing about losing vision is even when you don't feel like it, say I was actually sick sick, although my throat is really scratchy. I still have to talk to text to send the text. Most people who can see perfectly can text when they don't feel like speaking. Uh uh, I usually speak my text. Life's a trip, that's all I gotta say. Sephora has their sale. I swear it feels like my birthday came early. Precisely my brows, 4.5. This is gonna be the quickest haul of all, by the way. Oh, this is the VIB Rouge birthday gift, a tricep from Knight. So I need new foundation, so I finally got this one that everyone's been raving about for months now. It is just the revamped version of the Makeup Forever HD, which I've been buying for six to seven years now. I love this packaging. I like that they made the lid match. Yo, this doesn't look like my shade though, but that's what it said on Sephora. So I will try this the next time I film. If it doesn't work, then you guys know why. And if anything, I'll go to the Sephora, which is literally a block away. Why did I order online if I could have gone to Sephora in store? Because I can zoom in on the screen and see what I'm buying instead of struggling. This doesn't look like my color though. And I got a re-up of the best lip gloss ever and it's 30% off because they do 20% off for everything and then 30% off for Sephora collection. This is in the color Busy. If you don't know, now you know. Thebomb.com. It's blessed. And I need it, you know me. Lips are perhaps one of my favorite products. Used to be blush a couple years back. Everyone's been telling me that the Fenty Lip balm is really good, so I decided to try it in the color Latte, I think. I think it's like Latte Lover, Latte Lips or something. It's about time that I got the Butter Drop, and this one is the limited edition gold one. So it hits and checks two boxes. I'm so excited for this. I wanted to try something from Rare Beauty. So I got this duo, oops, it was upside down, of a liquid eyeliner, which I already know I'm going to have a hard time with. I haven't used a liquid aligner in two years because two years ago I was struggling and suffering. But we'll see. Maybe I won't look that crazy. And then the mascara, which I heard is really good. People keep raving about it on TikTok, but I don't really, I don't really trust TikTok reviews. I'll explain that in another video for you. But yeah, that's the shortest haul of all. I'm not gonna do a designated video like I have for the last seven years because there's no point. There's just a few things. So there it is. Tell me what you got down below. And I might place one more order because there's a birthday gift that I want to get for a friend. And this nail is really curved. And I also want to get Angel Share the full size because I loved the travel size last year. But I'm deciding between that and another fragrance. So I won't know until I go into the store and sniff it. But I want to make sure my nails is not so nasally when I do. So hopefully the sale's on for another week. On my way to get these brows did mask on. See when they look better. Aren't the colors of the leaves so pretty? The best thing about this neighborhood is everything I need is right here. I was able to get my brows done. Two doors down is my favorite pedicure place, so I got that did too. You saw that. Now I'm gonna go home. I don't know if I wanna cook another meal. I don't feel like cooking, but I mean, I never do, so there's that. I wish I could relax, but for real, for real, I have so much work to do. I'm super behind. I came home and I'm like, wait, is it just me or is my hair super fluffy? I look in the mirror, I'm like, wait, hola, 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 hola. I didn't realize until I went outside on my balcony that it's so foggy. That's why my hair absorbed all the moisture. That's how you know, she's thirsty. Anyway, I'm so happy my brows are perfect. She brings me the mirror. I'm like, don't even bother. I know it's good. She always does a good job. If I didn't mention it's Nola at Aroma, I'll put her deets over here, but highly recommend. I can't believe how much sleep I lost last night. Twitter shouldn't allow certain things to be shown. Like that takeoff video shouldn't be on there. I feel so bad for him and his family.
Pickles, though. What smoothie should I make today? I haven't had one in three days, so I'm so excited for this. This habit, I don't know what it is. I think I was traumatized the one time I didn't read the expiration date. You already know how that story's gonna go. There's still chunk in there. I wonder if it's defective or if it's just because this is the one, that's the actual name, the one, or if I'm not blending it enough, but we'll see if this time, come on, it tastes like something's off. the best news ever but it's not mine to share but what I will share is things are confirmed for Saturday well half I still need to figure out my dinner plans says a girl who worked in the restaurant industry for a decade and I don't have reservations for two days from now let's not talk about it I sound better today my mom roasted me last night she's like why are you taking a medicine that is giving you this reaction and then she scared me <laughs> I kind of want the one that has eucalyptus eucalyptus in it to get the last bit of sniffles out nope this one smells like medicine it must be it where's my phone i made a passion fruit mango pineapple i should have put ginger in there but i just put kale it's really really good so much better than last night's i don't know what was wrong with that one all right let's pour half the bottle in and pop her on Today is very misty. When I woke up, I was like, yo, is it Sleepy Hollow or what? It's giving Halloween three days late. It's also my cousin's birthday. <sighs> it's so good and it's so relaxing. It's called Rainforest, by the way. So if you ever want a really good, invigorating, but calming scent, trust me. Afternoon, I'm gonna do a quick 20 minute. I'm not gonna call this yoga because, according to what it says, it's more like an arm workout, which I need because I haven't been to pole in what two, three weeks. Not that I have any guns or anything, but whenever I went to pole class in the past, I realized there's so many muscles I don't activate. And PS, don't judge, okay? Just I'm on the way of recouping. I will look all right by tonight because it's my friend Jeff's party. So there's that. And at some point today, I also got to throw in doing laundry because I'm not doing that tomorrow. And there's one other thing I need to do, but first, let's just focus on this. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, no more, no more, no more. <laughs> Yeah, I'll visit you, but not tomorrow, because I'm not going to be in Toronto. Are you going out? I'm going to go to Niagara. Yeah, that's Yeah, something You're different. Yep. Yeah. That's good. Well, okay then. You will come on whenever you can. Yes, yes, yes. It won't be during the day and the week anymore, though. You go straight to travel for tomorrow. God bless you. Thank you, great grandma. Love you. You're very welcome, my dear girl. Think about you all the time. Thank you. You know, so. Love you. Love you too. We'll bye, bye bye. Bye bye bye. Bye dear. I am wearing the same dress. I keep hand washing it, but I should probably buy another one. They have a nice wine color, but it's sold out. Plus, do I really want to give Kim Kardashian any more of my coins? I'm about to say because when I need a shoulder, I'll ask you. The other day, I was thinking, how can I be a better friend to someone if, and I realized certain things that helps me in my life is when. I have a moment that I remember fondly um, that keeps me going. Honestly, say after we finished hanging out, we had such a good time. You would assume that with all of your good friends, but that is not true. <laughs> Things drain. <laughs> I cannot believe I got this. Something up. I'm in the mood to fuck something up. I'm in the mood 
For once, I'm not cheersing you yet. <laughs> I thought this is a dip. Yeah. It's a burger. I had no idea. That was the most misleading thing I've ever read in my life. I know we didn't know there was something on ours, beef too. Dip. Those are real. Yeah, it's a roast beef dip yeah. sandwich. Oh. You dip it in the glass. Where's this plastic cups? Because I know it's not like wash this. Afternoon loves. If you've seen this background before, you already know where I am. It's too much to explain, but this is just how random birthdays go. I'm happy that we stopped off here though. Super happy to see my stepdad and two of my closest friends to meet him. Just having a little iced coffee because that 4 a.m. bedtime is a no for me. Anyway, I'm gonna chill here for a little bit and then we're gonna go to another wine tasting because the first was more of a restaurant with the wine. Whereas the second one is going to be more of a wine tasting in Niagara vibe, but I'm excited. Today is such a beautiful day. I couldn't have asked for a better birthday. The weather is so nice and mild. The dress is dressing okay. It's giving profesh, although I should have probably got it tailored a bit, but whatever. It's all good. What's not good is I should have washed my hair, but don't say nothing. Why this man likes to show everyone random things is beyond me. As for you. <laughs> Every time. <laughs> it tastes like blueberry jam to me, a little bit of blueberry cobbler on the nose. It's not too deep. Low, that Merlot that I poured for you earlier, I bought I bought one, put it on my shelf, promised myself I would leave it for a year. <laughs> And then ended up like two weeks later. I was like looking at two it. weeks. Two weeks. It didn't even last two weeks. On my I was show. only I was here on the fifteenth, and I'm already down like four of the wines. That <laughs> this I've one is really unique too because it spends time in acacia wood, and it's the only varietal here at Belaterra that um, does spend time in acacia. It's straight from Africa. No cream cold November. No lions. <laughs> So we are on Niagara-on-the-Lake, which is like a little city that is near Niagara Falls. And we've done our two wine tastings for the day. We're going to chill. Don't worry, I've done this before. There's I can't no see cross. anyway. I know, there's no crossing here. I mean, I don't see when I jaywalk I'm anyway. I'm going to get hit by a car also. I have two sighted people that are going to get me across the street safely. <laughs> okay, hold on. <laughs> Meanwhile. Oh, Funko. What's that? Okay, He's thank stopping you. for us. A little small town. Thank you. Do you see this one? She's shopping like it's going out of style. What the heck? <laughs> Do you want to try it? Kind of. Okay, let's try it. And that's third. Sorry, did I grab? It's fine. What did you get? Hi, hey kids, I need to learn French and Italian. That's what I'm saying. I want to learn French. Bonjour, bon anote. Let's see if you can do it. What is that? I don't want to. I don't know. I don't know. Be as dry as dry can be, I still would drink it. And Dufferin. That's where it's jungle is. Really? Yeah. Really? Um, so, so, Aaron Carter. Yo, Aaron Carter. I know. Sam told us at the wine Aaron tasting. Carter? Yeah, Aaron Carter passed away. Aaron Carter, Aaron Carter passed away? Yeah. Today. My crush. I'm her. My on this Oh, no, I'm scared from that. Get out. Yeah, I've only seen Get Out too. No, Get Out is amazing. I, 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 I could watch that over the... What are you guys singing? Jojo. Oh. Get down. Get okay. Down. Is this karaoke night? Can we? <laughs> Should we all go to karaoke Oh right my now? god, don't get Sam started on karaoke. No one ever goes to karaoke. Genevieve's like, it's past my bedtime. I go to karaoke. It's love. We're sending you the... Christian. Sarahe. 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 Yeah. 
Wow. Oh my God, you and my cousin would love each other. <laughs> I wish I was Korean. I just don't want to read subtitles, so I'm learning the language.